today I'm gonna share with you uh, the new exciting thing going on in my studio. I have a new jeweler's bench and I'm so excited about it. I um, actually happened to run across it this weekend. We were garage sailing, my husband and I, we were out early Saturday morning. There is a um, citywide garage sale here in my town and they had it this weekend and everybody gets out all of their stuff, all of their crap, old junk, whatever they wanna get rid of. And then, I mean, people in the city just get out early in the morning, 6 a.m., they just go diving for stuff. So um, we got up about, oh, well, I was up that morning with my little uh, teether, because she's about uh, 11 months old and she's not exactly sleeping re really well right now. She's teething a lot. So I was up about four in the morning and, I, and then by the time I got her back to sleep, I was like, all right, I might as well just get up. It was like 7.30, I said, let's just get up and go. So we went garage sailing. And uh, one of the last places we came upon was, um, come to find out, the, um, the local jeweler here in town who had just retired. And um, I, when I realized who this guy was, I was like, oh my gosh, he's gotta have some awesome stuff. He had already sold uh, a lot of his tools, a lot of the stuff out of his shop, and I, w I was bummed for a little bit. And then, and then I saw a few tools laying in a little, little box over in the corner, and I said, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do some digging. So I went, I went diving into some boxes and found some really cool tools. And, um, and I was like, what do you want for these? And he was like, oh, five bucks, 10 bucks. And I was just like, seriously, these are worth a ton and he was like I'm done I'm I'm done being a jeweler I, I just I want to retire and quit so he said you know some of the stuff he was like just take it just take it if you want to take it and I was like okay you're my new best friend <laughs> so anyway um, by the end of our conversation I was like okay do you have anything else what do you have you know I'm really interested and I said I I'd love to see anything else you have and he said well I have an old I have an old bench but I didn't think anybody would want it and it's out back and I was like oh my I have to see this thing so he took me out back and um, under this tarp it was covered in spiders granddaddy long legs dust cobwebs and I was like okay <laughs> what's gonna be under this thing and he pulled off the tarp and it and it was his old jewelry bench and just, I mean, years of work and nicks and cuts and scrapes all over this desk. And, and my husband looked at me like, that's, that's a pile of junk, you, you want that? And, and I was like, honey, you have, no idea, you have no idea what this thing is. And so um, I said, what do you want for it? And, and he, goes, he goes, well, I was getting ready to burn it. And I said, burn it? I was like, oh my gosh, <laughs> don't burn this thing. And he goes, he goes, if you want it, if you'll use it, take it and, and uh, just have it, it's yours. And I said, I love you, <laughs> thank you so much. So, uh, so I took it, my husband and his brother, they brought it home. Um, they brought it home on Saturday and it's, uh, it's sitting out on my front porch. So today, um, I'm gonna, I'm up early again this morning and I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna clean it up a little bit, uh, do a little bit of quick restoration on it. Hopefully it won't take a lot of work. Um, I think it's gonna take a little bit of wood glue um, and just mainly cleaning up and getting the gunk off and the spiders off and everything. So I'm gonna show that to you um, as you can see my, my brand new exciting find. So anyway, come with me and I'll, uh, I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, it's out here on my porch right now because it, um, it needs some help. It's um, pretty spidery and dusty and dirty and the drawers are falling out and falling off the hinges and so I'm gonna gonna give it uh, a little bit of wood glue and some cleaning up and polishing today and I'm not gonna change too much of it because I I mean as you can see it's just I mean it's I mean years of work and hard labor on this desk um, the guy that I got it from was um, as a jeweler was a jeweler here in town um, and he uh, he worked a lot with watches so this is I think it's technically a watchmaker's bench um, and it's a uh, if you can see here try to zoom in a little bit it is a GH Rossberg manufacturing company out of Chicago uh, that is uh, that's the type of desk this is it's, it's made by the GH Rossberg manufacturing company um, and that is a very one of the most popular popular bench making companies that there ever has been so after I realized what it was I mean I was just I was just floored that he had this desk um, this bench 
And then uh, when I got home and did some research, I was just like, oh my gosh, this is this is awesome. So, and he uh, he also threw in the uh, the little lamp that goes with it. Um, so I'm gonna be uh, working on that today, getting it all cleaned up, and hopefully this will just this is just gonna be an awesome piece. I'm so excited. So anyway, um, there you go. There's my new uh, there's my new project <laughs> for the next couple days. Hopefully it won't take me too long to to get done. Um, I've got to got to glue some parts together. That's probably gonna take the longest. But anyway, I'm gonna get uh, get working on on that this morning as it's already hot in here. It's supposed to be up to 90 degrees or so today. So, whoo, it's hot in the Midwest. So I'm gonna get to work um, early this morning and. Uh, Get cracking on this thing. So anyway, I wanted to share that with you.